Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Back with another video. It's very early in the morning so I'm talking a little bit not as loud because I've already still uh, sleeping. Boys are already up. Preston is about to leave to walk the dogs and I'm about to start on breakfast. I have few plans for today. Uh, so later on I'm going to go and work out in our community gym. Just a very quick workout and after that I'm going to have breakfast and I'm going to start heading to my therapy session. I started therapy um, a couple of weeks ago and this is my second visit so I don't really know exactly what to expect but um, my therapist seems very nice and we're just talking about things. So we'll see if that's gonna help a little bit with my depression and stuff like that. Later on I'm gonna come back home and switch with Preston. So he's gonna go to work and I'm gonna watch Aurora, pick up kids from school and so on. So if you want to see how this day goes, then please stay tuned. So now that my work at home is done, I'm going to the gym. It's very close, but I'm riding my mobility scooter. So um, I know a lot of you will probably have a question why I'm going to the gym on a scooter. So the thing about my type of dwarfism is that I have a dysplasia um, of multiple joints, including my hips. So for me, uh, the low impact exercises are good and the high impact, which walking and running usually is, is not that good. Um, so I mainly do like a bike riding or swimming or uh, elliptical because they don't put too much pressure on my hips and the walking itself is not very good for my joints. Eventually I will have to do, um, I will have to have a hip replacement surgery but basically the longer I'm able to preserve the condition of my hips, the longer I will not have to do the surgery. So that is the plan. I'm going to the gym. It's going to be just like a 10 minute workout. I'm trying to get back into the routine of working out. And it's been a little bit hard uh, while Preston was working in the morning. So now he switched his schedule to evening for the next few months. So I'm able to work out in the morning. So now kids are sitting down to eat and they're already dressed for school. So once they're done eating, he's going to take them to school. I'm going to do a little quick workout. I'll be back home, have my breakfast and do some editing and I'm going to leave for my doctor's appointment. So that is the plan. My workout is done. That was very quick, about 10 or 15 minutes. I don't do much of different exercises. I'm just trying to... Basically my goal is to get into the routine and I also was... Um, prescribed to do a physical therapy for my legs so I just do a couple of exercises from my physical therapy recommendations so that is the goal just trying to get used to going back to the gym there were a couple of people in the gym I when I go there earlier usually it's empty hi good morning but it's still much less people than in like a big 
gyms where you have to pay for subscription so I'm very grateful that I actually get to go to the gym right here and I don't have to drive anywhere and I don't have to pay monthly other than our HOA so I'm gonna go back home it's about 10-15 minutes before kids leave for school today's their picture day so they're gonna look great today and I will have a minute to say uh, wish them a good day and say goodbyes and I will pick them up after school. Here's my breakfast for today. This is overnight oats with almonds, coconut and uh, I believe strawberries. I made it a couple days ago. It should be pretty good. So this is my breakfast for today. I'm just gonna watch a video and hang out for a few minutes. I was hoping I would have time in the morning to edit or jump in a shower but it seems like I will probably have to leave shortly after my breakfast because I actually spilled Preston's coffee accidentally and I spent a lot of time cleaning it up. I just finished. So I cleaned up the flooring and stuff, but I was not able to clean this spill that's like all over the wall. I washed it and this is as good as it got on the side. It got better on the other side, but I still feel like if this is how it looks after cleaning, then I will have to repaint it. So that is one more thing on agenda this week. And that took quite a bit of time to clean this mess, but that's okay. I'm just gonna have breakfast, chill in the quiet house while kids are gone in school and get this day started. So I'm done with my breakfast and I'm going to my doctor's appointment. Today I have a therapy session for my depression and anxiety and all that. This is my second section right after evaluation for it so I don't really know if it's going to be beneficial at all but my insurance covers it and that's a good thing uh, they said that I'm going to have only eight sessions that's what my insurance covers but I figured that there is no harm in trying this therapy is going to take a big chunk of my day it's like 45 minutes there 45 minutes to come back and and about an hour to be there but I hope it's worth it and I'm actually talking to my mom on whatsapp while I'm driving so I'm having a very productive morning so far so this is much later during the day the electronics are gone animatronics are gone yes, yes. <laughs> They're in San Diego. Yep, so I picked up kids from school and Xavier wanted to come to the Chuck E. Cheese. And he wanted to see animatronics and we came here and they're gone. So now we're just hanging out and playing. We're gonna spend here maybe an hour or two. You know, just something a little different for kids to do. Good job, Kara. Nice. Hi, baby. <laughs> Nice. I touched the water. You did? Yep. Okay, well, it's not super thick. Can you go put it back? Thank you. Okay, thank you. It's over there. Thank you. Good job. Thank you. Come on, throw it. Good job. And more. Good job. Good job. You look so relaxed. <laughs> Good job. No. Good job. <laughs> Good job. Nice. Good job. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> 
Whoa, again? Wow!